Firefox 11 was released very recently. This video is not about Firefox 11, but I figured I would mention it. So just to show you, this is Firefox 11. And the biggest thing about this is that it can now migrate bookmarks, history, and cookies from Chrome. And with sync enabled, add-ons can now be synchronized across your computers, which I guess is cool. Other than that, well, not really much to uh, write home about, so to speak, but I figured I'd mention that first. But anyway, this is about Chrome. I found this feature quite by accident. Now, I don't know how long it's been in Chrome, but it's awesome. This is Chrome 17.0.963.79, and I was uh, researching some options on how to print things from a browser. So I hit the wrench menu and I go to print and I notice, what's this? Print to PDF. And it will. If I hit print, I can save it. Oh my God, that's so awesome. And there it is, I got a PDF. And you know what the best part about this is? I didn't have to have anything installed other than Chrome. Well, and a PDF reader, of course. Um, but even if you don't have a PDF reader, you could still view that in the browser. So if I drag this here and I just drag the uh, PDF into Chrome, it'll view it with its native PDF reader. How freaking awesome is that? I mean, there are just little things about Chrome that make it awesome and that is definitely one of them. So again, if you're on any website, just hit wrench and go to print and you'll have it. Print the PDF. Now, this is a uh, virtual XP that I'm running right now in, it looks like Windows 2000, but I have it set this way just because I was experimenting with some things. But anyway, the point is, is that if you've got Chrome right now and you've uh, latest version, which you probably do since it auto updates itself in the background, you've got the print to PDF option and even if you don't have a PDF reader you can just drag it right in and oh, let me try that again oh wait it's because I got the print dialog activated let me close that and then just drag it right in nifty 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 cool awesome there's only one bad part and only one and this is a nitpick is that none of the uh, links are active in the PDF. It doesn't translate the links uh, when you do it this way, but minor, minor trade-off. And it is true that the formatting won't be the same probably, but the point is, is that this is ready to go to a printer now because PDFs is uh, the true what you see is what you get type of thing. Whatever you see in a PDF is what's going to come out on that 8.5 by 11 sheet if you print it. It's also awesome for sending an email and uh, posting to the cloud and everything. So yeah, do that print to PDF thing. You don't even need a driver. You need nothing except Chrome. I can't go on about how cool this is, but I'll stop here. Try it for yourself. It's great.